All right, let's change gears. Talk about the weather here. Uh, I was pleasantly surprised when I walked outside this morning. It's comfortable out there. It is uh, actually temperatures are dropping to where they should be at for this time of year, at least in parts of Miami Dade, Keith. And uh, that means also uh, we're just going to keep things seasonable once again for this afternoon. It'll be nice out there and look at these temperatures right now. Kendall falling to 64 degrees, 66 in Miami, 65 in Homestead. Now the keys are in the lower 70s and so is coastal Broward, Pompano Beach at 73, 71 in Fort Lauderdale. Notice that the winds are much lighter. I mean, they're becoming calm across much of South Florida, and this is actually helping for temperatures to drop into those 60s as we see across Miami-Dade, even for Western Broward as well. All right, real time Doppler not picking up on any rainfall. It's a dry start. And if you want to take the boats out early on, well, you certainly can. I, the seas have improved significantly. Uh, the seas are topping two feet and the base at a light chop. It's a light wind for today, five to 10 miles per hour east southeast uh, for beachgoers. The rip current risk for today is at a moderate level, so that has decreased as well. Use the sunscreen. UV index is very high. We'll get to see a lot of that sunshine with a, just a few clouds mixing in. High pressure still in control basically over the sunshine state. It's a strong high. It's not going to allow any fronts to come through, not just yet, but there is a front potentially coming our way by Friday, so by the end of next week. So here's the setup. This is the moisture forecast. Look at this dry air that's sticking around over the Caribbean, the Bahamas. And then by Friday, there's that line of moisture. That's that front I just mentioned. So we have until Thursday with mainly dry conditions. However, Thursday is going to be quite humid and warm and then especially Friday out ahead of the cold front. We could even have the chance for maybe a few showers and, an, and a few thunderstorms Friday as the front passes through. Of course, it's still too soon to know exactly how much rain we'll get. But of course, we'll keep you posted here on here on CBS 4. All right, highs today 81 degrees, a quiet night tonight. Temperatures dropping into mainly the upper 60s. If the winds become calm, could drop into the mid 60s, which is near normal for this time of year. Here's a look at the seven day forecast. So as we head into St. Patrick's Day, it's going to be a little bit breezier, but nice and sunny and of course warm. That's when we start hitting the upper 80s, very warm out ahead of that next front that will be coming our way early on Friday. Keith? Got some warm stuff coming. Okay, thank you.